Hi everyone and welcome to the mini toy love channel and today I'm really excited to be opening some new miniature toys called Whiffies which that is an adorable name and they're called Whiffies because they're scented and they're all themed to these cute little animal critters with these fuzzy tails that are scented and I have one of the two pack ice cream cones to open as well as the cute little s'mores three pack and they look super whimsical I like the art style I like the dessert theme with little animal critters you can't go wrong so they're made by spin master as well and i found them at walmart on a recent toy hunt can't wait to see which ones we get let's go ahead and get started i'm going to start with our s'mores three pack it looks like you get these three characters one is visible and again like a really cool art style this is the tail and back which looks like they're posable where you can swirl them together to create your scented concoction and it looks like there's gonna be like some fruit ones. I think on the side, oh yeah, there's root beer, there's a frappuccino, so fun stuff. Oh, there's a pickle. So we have sweet and savory ones as well. Okay, so let's get this open. It looks like it's taped up top. It says love at first whiff, that's cute. <laughs> so the other two figures you get are blind bag, which I appreciate that. And then we'll take a look at our figure, she's so cute. But first, let's look at the checklist. So there are 20 different ones to collect. And look at all these little cuties. What a fun variety. Here is our three pack. And then on the back, it gives you like a little flavor combo menu. Look at the popcorn, there's the pickles. And then these are like the different combos you can make. Where do they put the pickles? I don't know, <laughs> but there's a QR code you can scan to see the twist. That's interesting. So a really cute idea, and thus far, again, I like the, the theming and creativity behind these cuties. So our first visible character is the marshmallow for our s'mores, and her name is Marnie Mallo. And look at how sweet. She has the little braids in her hair that she's just kind of holding. Again, I don't know if she's a squirrel or just some whimsical creature. She has little marshmallow pigtail toppers, and then here's her tail which is so pretty with the blue, the white, the pink streak, and then even some orange. So I really like the color combo. She doesn't have any moving parts except for the tail. So this has a wire in it and you can bend it and intertwine them together. And she is scented like marshmallows and it kind of reminds me of the Pick Me Pops marshmallow scent, but not as strong because <laughs> some Pick Me Pops were like, oh, that's, that's a lot of Pick Me Pop scents. But these ones are, are kind of pleasantly scented thus far. And again, I really like the art style on your little animal critters. Super cute. And you can kind of bend the tail to get them to stand or sit up. They don't come with the base, and of course the tail makes them a little top heavy, but again, if you intertwine them, I'm sure you can kind of balance them. Okay, so then we have our first blind bag, which that's fun. I, I like that. Ooh, I think it's a chocolate one. Oh, yes. Ooh. Her tail is a different um, material. So this one's more like that fluffy hair. This one feels arm almost like, not yarn, it's a little bit thinner than yarn, but hopefully you guys can see that. It feels like shag carpet. <laughs> and this is Coco Carly. Ooh, look at Coco Carly. She a kitty, she's, she's something, but she's adorable. I love the face. Look at the little cute noses on these. She has some drizzle, the hair has a drizzle. Very cool purple ponytail with the chocolate piece there. What a fun minifigure. And so the tail can, can straighten out too, but I didn't realize they would have different, different textures. Really love that purple and brown. I think that's a really cool color combination. And she does smell like chocolate. It is a lighter scent, which is nice. It's not too overpowering, but you can definitely pick up chocolate. And she stands up rather nicely with that big poofy tail. Again, there's that wire inside, so that's that's awesome. And then here's our last one, which should be our graham cracker to complete our s'mores. Oh, fun. Okay, so she has a tail texture like our chocolate one. Oh, how pretty. Wow, I love the colors and how they all kind of meld together. This is Gr Gabby Graham. <laughs> Gabby Graham. It's like so many different color gradations in, in the fluff. That's awesome. And then she has cute hot pink hair. Look at her little style. There's the graham crackers. So it looks like their hair accessories are going to be their signature food items. Little graham cracker looking like sp sprinkles. 
super cute and she smells more sort of like a butter cookie versus graham cracker but she actually smells really good <laughs> so there's that and again the color combos are just so pretty so then you can twirl them all together to make like a combo scent that forms the s'more scent and it combines all their fun colored tails too and they're just all three besties <laughs> And we have our ice cream set that comes with two little whiffies inside. And these are ones that you can just find in the blind bags. <laughs> and this also has a stamped number here. I don't know if it's a code, but that's always something to look out for just in case. To cut down on duplicates is so important because the toys don't buy themselves. <laughs> that is for sure. And here's a look at the back of the packaging, which has the Whiffy's ice cream cone on it. So that's actually really cute. And this part is sort of like a hard paper, so I don't know if there is a pull tab or anything. So I'm just going to use, use my fingers, or scissors could possibly work better. I'm assuming they'll be blind bags. Oh yeah, so you can open it like so, which is cool because then you have sort of like a little mold for the ice cream. Which is fun. I could see that being reused for, for whatever. I don't know. <laughs> Sand? <laughs> so you can actually take all the paper off. So there, there you go. You have a little ice cream. <laughs> and it comes with the same checklist and the two shiny silver blind bags. So let's start with this one, which is the pair tab. And inside, oh, how cute. We have this little elegant girl. So this is whipped cream willow. And I love the little dollop of whipped cream buns. And again, look at how precious the little art style is. She's wearing a little bracelet. And then she has sort of a, a tricolored tail. Now her tail is the same material as our cute little marshmallow one. So that's cool. So maybe there's just two different textures. Oh, look, it's the a little drizzle down her back and to me she smells kind of like a vanilla cream which is pretty cool and I will say there's a little like fluff loss if you can see that um, with some of these they don't come with brushes but you can probably use like a dull brush and maybe get some of the excess fluff off um, but there's just a little that you can kind of see on my table so cute Okay, and then here is our last little Whiffy's blind bag. Oh, we have someone green. Oh, that fell. <laughs> That's for dramatic effect. It's either going to be a pickle or a banana one. Oh my goodness, I think we do have the pickle. Okay, I was really curious about this one. So this is more of like the thicker yarn tail. And how cute is she? She has her tongue sticking out. Okay, she, she a pickle. That's, that's adorable. I like the black and green hair. She's has little buns, little pickle slices there. She's winking. Oh, she's really cute. And the tail looks like it's just one green. Oh, it gets a little dark here. So it goes from a little dark, it's hard to tell on camera, to light. But it's it's probably the least color variation of all of them. Okay, so let's, let's give her a, a little whiff and see if she smells like pickle. And yep, she smells like pickle. This is probably the most realistic pickle scent I've ever smelled. It's like a salty, briny, but pickle juice like <laughs> scent at the same time, um, which is kind of crazy, but they, they pulled it off to where it's not like gross um, and it's not overpowering, which I appreciate in all these scents. So here we go. Of course, we have Piper Pickle because <laughs> you, you got to do that. And I like the little pink down her face. That's a cute cute mix up from the green and black and I think their pickle combo was to combine pinkle, pickles with sprinkles which I could I don't know if I'd eat that in real life but I could see where it's sort of sprinkles sometimes don't like really have a flavor but are just colorful and fun which she is too Here's another look at the five little whiffies we opened today. You guys will have to let me know which was your favorite one or what do you think of whiffies in general? Feel free to leave me a comment down below. As for me, I really find this series to be super cute. I'm always on the hunt for a food theme collectible with cute little animals, so you can't go wrong there. I mean, we haven't had a lot of food and animal combos since like Num Noms, although LPS has some really cute series that did that well too. So I'm really excited about Whiffies. If I had to choose a 
fave one only i would choose coco carly i really love her design she's the only one that's kind of walking and i like her color combination but overall i'm very pleased with this opening and i do want to find some more as well and that'll do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope to see you in my next video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.